All right, hello. Um, just changing a clutch pedal on a Ford KA uh, 2009. Um, it's broken on, on the weld that Ford's or Fiat make. Let me just swim in it. Now, this is the clutch pedal that's broken, as you can see. Whoops. As you can see, this is broken away. They only weld it to the first section of plate. It's not welded on the second section of plate. So the pedal starts to flop about like this uh, and makes a, a horrible clicking sound. So if you've got one of these Fiat, Fiat maybe Fiat 500s, um, Ford KA, um, it is based on, on Fiat, the Ford KA, the later one. Um, yeah, you've got to change the pedal. Uh, an expense of £305 from Ford's, which is a bloody joke. Um, so what I did to give me a bit of room, I removed the accelerator pedal. I've just tucked it up there to get it out of the way. There is a clip here, and there is a C-clip. I can show you on the end. Let me get this light near a few. On the end of that shaft, now there is a spring. I took a picture of the spring just in case. Um, and basically, what I did, you can unhook the spring and it will flop down anyway. So, but I left it on there for the minute. Um, and what I did is I, I unhooked this C clip and pulled the shaft back enough to get the pedal out. I had to release the steering column one bolt slide it up it can only go back on one way it's got a key weight you have to pop off the um, slave cylinder and i pulled the shaft back um, enough just enough up to this sort of point so the pedal can fall out uh, put the spring on the pedal the spring hooks in to this bit here it goes over and hooks and the tail end pushes up into a plastic housing and makes the pedal return now on reversal of fitting you've got to be careful when you're putting your pedal in there you don't smash up your master cylinder it is a hydraulic clutch uh, basically when you pull that pin out uh, put it back in but I found the c-clip a bit of a task to get on so um, what I did and also restriction of room and everything. I took this clip off from this side and pushed the shaft out so it just protrudes a little bit to make it easier. Then I managed to push the clip on and push it down with my hand with a lever bar. Uh, not up against anything, just pushing onto the clip and it clicked. And then I managed to tap the shaft back and then put this clip on, which has got a tab that goes over the top. It will not fall down. It can't fall down that clip so all is good um, yeah so I mean I could turn that clip round and face it that way uh, uh, face it that way I suppose but that's not going to come off it's got a little locking tab flicks over so uh, that's it now I've got to put the um, where's the accelerator pedal I did try to disconnect the electrical connector but some of these bloody connectors they've got in these cars today. Absolutely crap. So yeah, three bolts, two at the top, one at the bottom. Yeah, two, uh, three 10 mil bolts. I'll tell you what, the vehicle, what's it done? Let's have a look. That's what it's done. And the pedal's snapped. It's today's vehicles are just rubbish. And they just seem to break and it just made a crap, basically. But yeah, that was it. Um, I thought I was gonna have to take the whole pedal box out, but luckily I did not. So yeah, job done. I've just got to bolt this accelerator cable back on and put this panel back here. I just removed this panel to give me a bit more visibility. Um, you can't take all this panel out of the way. It wouldn't help anyway, because the steering covers there anyway, and there's all this metal plate behind there but it gave me a little bit more visibility through here so it's job done now thank you